Hey, how's it going everybody? This is going to be a comparison video between the SH Figuarts Goku Black, the event exclusive Super Saiyan Rose, and then the bare bones Super Saiyan Rose. Uh, this guy is definitely very hard to try to acquire nowadays. Um, this one costs a hundred dollars back in the day. Yeah, you can still see the tag right there. So yeah, this one cost about a hundred. That was like a couple years ago though. Now I know he's gone up a lot more, but I think you can find them for like I don't know 120 between 120 and 150, but he's definitely expensive, he's not cheap. Um but yeah, I'm gonna be comparing because this guy does come with um extra accessories and this one doesn't. This one's just a figure, but then the price on this one is just $35, and you really can't go bad with a $35 figure of this guy, so yeah, that's what we're going to do today. So, hope you guys enjoy. And there you go. As you can see, this is what they look like outside of the box. Let me get that camera angle better. So, as you can see that the $35 figure, which is, like I said, that's a good deal. Especially if you want to do scenes where, um, you know, you use some clones that's the way to go you know 35 is not bad i have like i have a few of this one so definitely um this one only comes with three additional face plates five extra interchangeable hands and then the event exclusive on my right comes with an extra seven different exchangeable hands three face plates which is the same amount as this one but this one comes with the uh key blade uh as well as the aura effect in the back so that's definitely the big difference right there. So let's go ahead and crack these guys out and see what they look like. All right, so real quick, like I said, um, I'm gonna. This is the aura effect that the event exclusive comes with. It's actually a very nice uh, rose aura effect. Nice plastic. You can see it's nice and thick on the bottom. So it looks on the back. It's got a lot of detail still there as well. A lot of detail, which is awesome. And a lot of detail in the front, so definitely an awesome aura effect. Like I said, if, if if you guys are like tight on money or you're on a budget and you know you at least want to get the figure and you're not really tripping on this or these, then you know always try to make it work however however it works out for your wallet. You know, that's the main thing you gotta look out for. So definitely, and it comes with these as well. These go on the ground like that, so looks like that so that's pretty cool so yeah and there's the other accessory it comes with the energy blade so that's pretty awesome it's definitely translucent as you can see yep but it's definitely a nice effect to have it's definitely got a, like a slight metallic touch to it you can see that with the light reflecting off of it so that's cool all right, so actually let me adjust the camera a little bit again. So there you go. The one on my right is the event exclusive. And the one on my left is the uh, $35 bare bones figure. So um, there are slight differences in the body as you can see. They're both, they both still have that that kind of rosé tint to them like this one might be black on the pants and arms but you can see a slight tint this is the event exclusive on my right by the way on the event exclusive you can still see a little bit of a tint i don't know if you can see it on camera there's still a little bit of pink highlights or details here and there a little spray on there uh, on the gi right here on the top part so yeah there's still enough of it to separate this body from base form the uh like the maniacal fit or the uh, or the other um, sh figure arts Goku black body whereas those are completely black so on this one his gi is got a dark purple tone and like i said there's a little highlight there you can see you see hopefully yeah you can see it right down the leg see that's on the event exclusive as well and even though they look different they both have that this one is more of a lighter all-around color uh the pants you can see are lighter the uh the sleeves and then just the whole outfit all around is a little lighter except for the sash the sash is actually 
darker red than the one on the uh, event exclusive so there's that so this right here is the $35 figure and like I said you can this one you can see it a lot stronger like the all the highlights you can see the uh, rosé the rosé right there here and there all the pink details look cool right there you can see it right there on the back so yeah, um, let me see on this guy on the back. Yeah, a little less on him, but like I said, overall, it's still not a completely black gi like the other two for base form. This is more fitting for that. So yeah, and the other big difference I'm going to say is definitely the uh, the head sculpts, the hair sculpts actually, because this the, the $35 figure on my left is actually not it's pretty solid it's just solid it's not translucent the event exclusive is a little translucent i don't know if you could see let me see if, I, if you could tell some of the light coming through maybe yeah this one is definitely translucent so there's that but they both have that metallic pearlescence on it so there's very slight differences to the actual color oh there you go you can probably see on the event exclusive here that it's a little more translucent this one's just solid so you know some of you might like it just solid or some of you might not mind or want the translucent one so that's pretty cool let me see if i can show you guys what that looks like real quick <clears throat> here we go Does it show? Yeah, well. There you go. See, you could tell that the light goes through. It's definitely translucent. So if you wanted to put like a light effect behind it, that's what it'll pretty much look like. Let me get that focus in. There you go. All right. And you can tell... That this one is not translucent the light does not go through right so and there you go i'm going to show you guys the faces now real quick they um are there are slight differences i'm not gonna lie but they're not significant they're definitely minimal so let me see if i can get those in there because the uh All right, and there you go. I'm trying to get the, uh, there you go. As you can see, the details are definitely slightly different. The eyes on this one are a little more of a lighter tone. And the, the ones on this one are more of a darker pinkish purple, more of a lighter pale purple type. The smirk is about the same. Other than that, not too much of a difference. So, yeah bangs kind of get in the way right there but they both definitely look good so we're going to go ahead and do articulation real quick so you guys can see so this is the 35 dollar one right here um, as far as looking up they're actually both limited when it comes to looking up he looks up about that much which is not a lot the hair gets in the way same thing with this one it goes about that much not a lot so they look like this together side by side definitely not a lot and then downward is a little better there you go so the one on my left is the $35 figure the one on my right is the event exclusive they both look down a lot better than the opposite direction so that's good this is the $35 one so the torso <clears throat> feels good bends forward about that much The ab crunch on this one feels about the same. Yeah, I would say about the same. You guys let me know what you guys think. And then it goes back about that much. And then the event exclusive goes back about that much. Actually, that kind of feels like it goes back a decent amount right there. No, they go about the same. Yeah, so there you go. That's actually really decent going backwards so <clears throat> and then kicking upward uh the bottom ends of the gi here is soft plastic but it does still kind of get in the way actually this one is probably softer this, this is the event exclusive 
You have an exclusive is on my right. The $35 figures on my left. The plastic gi at the end here on this one feels softer than this one. This one actually feels a little tougher, stronger. So a little less movement on the leg upward. But this one definitely feels like it goes up a lot. A little more. So. I don't know if you could tell. Let me stand them straight. Well, they look the same about right there. But it definitely feels smoother on him. So there's that. Then he can do the splits as well. <clears throat> about the same. So yeah, about the same on the splits. The one on my left is a $35 figure. And then the event exclusive on the right. So here you go. And then backwards. Backwards, um, they go about the same as well. Not too big of a difference. So yeah, all in all, it's pretty much the same mold. Um, you know, they both have their, their pros and cons. It, it all comes down to which one you want, what you can afford. Because like I said... The one on my left is a $35 figure. If you can't afford this one for $100, $150, then, you know, go for this one. If anybody finds this guy for less than $100, that's a deal, and you should probably jump on it. Because if you find this for, like, $75 or $80, that is not bad. That's a good deal. So, I would jump on that. Um, but, yeah. So, all right. I just showed you the smirking face. I'm going to swap um, the, I'm gonna show you the rest of the face plates, what they look like on their, on their, uh, on the bodies they come with. So now it's the serious face. So you'll be able to see the differences. Looks pretty good, right? Not too bad. Like I said, the eyes, there's always going to be a slight difference. Let me see if I can zoom in on those faces. There you go. Looks good, right? Okay, and here is the teeth gritted face on both of them. Event exclusive on my right. The $35 on my left. There you go. About the same thing when it comes to the faces. Let me get that to the side. Get the camera to zoom in real quick. Yeah, so there you go. Teeth gritted. They both look good. And there you go. This is the last but not least on the face plates. The screaming face plates. Get that camera to focus right. There you go. Yeah, so definitely both look good like i said it just comes down to your preference okay so now what i'm going to be doing is i'm going to be using or placing all the face plates from the 35 dollar figure on the event exclusive body and hair sculpt so you guys can see what they look like so we're going to start off with the teeth gritted one i'm going to try to go through this quick so it's not too long so we're going to start with the teeth gritted face plate Make sure I get that camera to focus. There you go. Looks good, right? It's looking off to the side. This is the screaming faceplate from the $35 figure on the event exclusive body and hair sculpt. So that's cool. And there's the serious face. Looks really good. All right, and last but not least, the smirking face. Looks good. And like I said, one more time, these are all the $35 face plates on the event exclusive body and hair sculpt, so you guys can see what they look like. Okay, so now I'm going to be doing the event exclusive face plates on the $35 Goku Black Super Saiyan Rosé body. The $35 figure. Serious face. Oh, I'm sorry, Smirk. 
looks good. Then we have the teeth gridded, looking to the side. Looks good. Then we have the serious face. good and one more time these are all the 35 i'm sorry these are the these are excuse me these are the event exclusive face plates on the 35 dollar uh goku black rose body and hair sculpt so and last but not least there's the event last uh there's the last event exclusive face plate screaming face on the $35 body and hair sculpt. Looks pretty good, right? Get that camera to focus better. Look at that. There you go. And there you go. I'm going to do one more side-by-side -side comparison. Move that around a little bit. One more side-by-side -side comparison uh, with the face plates. So the top row is the $35 Goku Black SH Figure Art body. And the bottom row are all the event exclusive face plates. So you guys can see the differences next to each other. So, yeah. Slight differences. Not too much. But, like I said, maybe you guys want both. Or it comes down to what you can afford. So, there you go. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Take care.